1 Samuel 18 is all about jealousy and the damage it can do. Now, jealousy might not seem like a big deal. In many people's minds, it may even rank uh, pretty low on the sin list. Might seem like a little white sin, not so bad. Some even may think a little jealousy is a good thing. It grows character, keeps you sharp. But we see in chapter 18 just the kind of damage that sin and jealousy can lead to. The chapter immediately begins by telling us the groundwork of jealousy that was being laid in Saul's heart. David becomes best friends with King Saul's son. He excels at every task he's given. It says in chapter 18, verse 5, whatever Saul asked David to do, David did it successfully. So Saul made him a commander over the men of war. An appointment was welcomed by the people and Saul's officers alike. Everybody loves David. They love David so much that after a successful mission, the people in verse 7 were literally singing his praises. Saul slain his thousands and David his tens of thousands. This caused Saul to be enraged in anger. How dare the people praise David over the king? Saul's jealousy and anger were rooted in fear and insecurity. Not only did the people love David, but Saul was afraid because David had God's favor as well. These feelings and insecurities allowed Satan to gain a foothold in Saul's life, eventually leading him to try to kill David multiple times. Jealousy in comparison are something that we all experience from time to time. But if left unchecked, it can become extremely dangerous, just as we see in Saul's life. We must remember to be confident in who God has called us and made us to be. We cannot give the enemy a foothold in our lives. We must recognize what God is doing in our own lives and embrace who he has made us to be instead of comparing ourselves to others and letting those seeds of jealousy take root. James 3, 13 through 16 says, if you are wise and understand God's ways, prove it by living an honorable life, doing good works with the humility that comes from wisdom. But if you are bitterly jealous and there is selfish ambition in your heart, don't cover up the truth with boasting and lying, for jealousy and selfishness are not God's kind of wisdom. Such things are earthly, unspiritual, and demonic. For wherever there is jealousy and selfish ambition, there you will find disorder and evil of every kind.